it's streaming so hard, it's not even worth it. Thus our adventure begins. Does it? No, no. Uh, personal file. Nothing. Okay. Close. Cell phone. Cell phone. Okay. I really don't have the strength to take this suitcase any further. I wonder who can help me. There's a glass ceiling for you. Huh, the world capital of mechanical toys. Let yourself be transported by the magnificent landscape surrounding Valadilen. A small charming town tucked away in the Alps and by Vorarlberg Manufacturing, whose exceptional savior fair in the specialized world of luxury mechanical toys and automations is at the root of Valadilen S reputation around the world. For 800 years, the Borova family has passed its knowledge from generation to... For 800 years! For 800 years. It's not... Yeah, it's... Okay. From generation to generation, perfecting the art of the particular branch of clockmaking that breathes life into the complex network of cogs and spindles that make up automatons. His creative wonders once defied belief and drew the admiration of young and old alike. People would come from across Europe for a chance to view to the another word. For a right to own one of these fantastic toys. Unequaled Savior Fair at the heart of mechanical automation. Uh, is it more? A series of spindles are set in motion to music via a set of cogs attached to the spindles are cams that are shaped in the image of the music. In turn they command a series of rods which control the gesture of the toy at their tips. Now that's too much reading. Uh, yeah, that's, that's way too much reading. I will probably need to find this key at some point. Uh, 
<laughs> okay. Done with that. <laughs> Wait, I can't go back there. Nothing to steal. <laughs> hi there. Hey, hi there. What are you doing? Can I see? No, too difficult. Momo's work very difficult. Your name's Momo. I'm Kate. Momo do like Hans. He draw. Hans? Don't disturb Momo. Momo work difficult. Momo Will is you a show me special. a drawing? No, not finished. Go away. I've just arrived. My case is a little heavy. Can you help me take it up to the room? Momo strong. Very strong. But no time. Momo, very busy. Always an asshole. I guess I'll let you continue working. What a bitch she asked the kid to carry her luggage. I need a key. I need a key. Do you? Oh, here's a key. I need a key. You have the key. Oh, oh, it's that's how it's going to be. Okay. Okay, okay, I'm coming. You lazy bastard. Hi there. Hello there, ma'am. I would like a room. My company should have made a reservation in the name of Walker. The company is Marson and Lormont Associates. The name is Kate Walker. Of course, Miss Walker. You are in room six on the next floor up. Thank you. Doo -doo -doo. Can you carry my bag for me? Could you possibly take my luggage up, please? Please do excuse me, Miss Walker. We have been neglecting our duties. Guests are so rare these days that we forget our manners. So you're the American woman? Is it true what people say? That you've come to buy the factory? Not factory. Anna's house. Hans' house. Excuse me? Would you quiet down, you mischievous little boy? No, oh, mischievous. I imagine our little town must disappoint you. You see, yes, today is very sad for us. It's a day of mourning. Today is the funeral of Miss Anna. Momo sad, but Hans not dead. Hans long way away. Anna told Momo. Anna liked Momo very much. That's enough, Momo. Stop pestering the lady. Now go on, scram. Get out of here, you hear? Oh, he's special. Oh. What was I saying? Oh yes, Miss Anna. Such a great loss for Valle de Laine, it really is. Because now that she's dead, the factory will close. But you're here to stop that happening, aren't you? Our future is in your hands, Miss Walker. You're about Walker. to be so disappointed. What? Anna Varlberg is dead? Here's your room. I hope you like it, Miss Walker. It's shit. 
I'll leave you to rest for the time being. You must have a lot of work to do. No. You know, the takeover of the factory is very good news for us here. It would make us very happy to see life return to our valley. It won't. You're fucked. If only you had seen Valadilen before. It was delightful. People came from all over the world to buy Vorlberg automatons. Ah, somebody has left you some mail, I see. Remember, if you need anything at all, we're not far away, Miss Walker. Momo, Automaton, Anna. Uh. Okay, Dark Land, the Universal Toy Company is more than eager to see conclusions from the talks with Vodaberg Manufacturing with view to a takeover in the days to come, and we have received notification to this effect. We are counting on your undoubted qualities as a business lawyer to bring negotiations with Madame Anna Vorlberg, the current owner, to a close. That's not gonna happen. Allow me to remind you that the Universal Toy Company is a multinational which has a monopoly on the toy market. It is a Class A priority client who is also presenting Madame Vorlberg with a golden opportunity to sell her factory. You should remind her of this fact in case she starts having last minute second thoughts before signing the purchase agreement. I'm under no doubt that you will live up to the great expectations I have for you. Edward, whatever. Telephone 12458902. Can I remember that? Can I? I don't think I can remember that. Telephone 12. Four, five, eight, nine, oh, two. I should tell Marson about the death of Miss Varlberg. Yeah, you should. This isn't going to get too complicated. I'm gonna forget I can't see myself birth. staying here too long. Oh. Oh. Hmm. Uh, sent. When people really don't like you. Foster isn't around to take your call right now, so please leave your message after the tone. Hmm. Marson and Lamont, how can I help you? Can you put me through to Mr. Marson, please? It's Kate Walker. Hold the line, please. <laughs> Hello, Kate. So tell me, how's the case going? I've just got to Valady Lynn, and there's a slight problem, Mr. Marson, I'm afraid. Mrs. Vorlberg is dead. Ah, that's most unfortunate. But I seem to remember we made provisions for just such a sad eventuality, and we know that there was no heir. Yes, that's right, but... So where's the problem, Kate? Contact the notary right away. I'll get my secretary to fax you his address and an introduction letter from the firm. Very good, Mr. Marson. Right. I gotta go, Kate. Keep me up to date, okay? I just... <sighs> <clears throat> okay. Can I just go to sleep? Can I call it a day? No? Okay. I don't need that for the time being. Okay. No need to go down there. Hmm. 
Hmm. Run. No need to go down there. Why is it active, bitch? No need to go down there. No need to go down there. No need to go down there. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that was a waste. No need to go down there. Down where? It's a door. Down there. Huh. Oh, he fucked the table. Little bastard. I'm back again. I'm expecting Miss a pax, you bastard. <laughs> Hello, my name is Kate Walker and of course, of course. Walker, room six, next floor up. A fax didn't arrive for me, did it? No. Nope. Maybe. I thought I heard the phone ring. Do you think you might want to go and check? No. Nope. Certainly, ma'am. Immediately. Thank you very much. I don't have any money to pay that guy for anything. There might be a Voltaire. Hmm. Other no doubt the weather, our practice is charged with undertaking negotiations with the moon. Uh, this is a great sense we the most recent debt manager owner factory Madame negotiations under doubt that Madame debt enabling the sale. We should remind you of the significant whatever. Kate Walker, a warm welcome. Wow. Thank you. At your service. Uh, uh, I'm gonna go look around Valadie Len. See you later. Yeah, I'm gonna As waste you like, my miss. time. Can you fuck off so I can steal something? No? no. I'm back again. Miss Walker? Did I'm I... gonna go look around Valadie Len. See you later. As you like, miss. Oh, it stopped raining. No need to go down there. Down where? It's a door. Good morning. Good morning? What a pleasure to meet such a lovely young lady honoring our aging streets. Please, uh, please sit yourself down next to me so we can enjoy the air together. It would be you a pleasure, think. but I'm afraid I don't have the time. Some other time, maybe. I hope so, miss. I remember when these streets were full of vibrant life. In those days, there was a charming encounter to be had round every corner. Ah, our good little town of Valadilen is not what it used to be. No, it's It looks not. like things have changed a bit around here. Our children have all left the valley. 
They need to earn a living, don't they? Can't really blame them. You have to move with the times, don't you? And it's not at the Vorlberg factory that they'll find jobs. <laughs> Being excluded from the world is not an easy burden to bear, believe you me, miss. But it's such a pretty little village. Uh, I can tell you're not from these parts. I hope you enjoy the pleasures that we still have to offer. Good day to you. Uh, the music is too loud. This changed nothing. Did it change anything? Hello again. If you have five minutes to sit and talk, I could tell you a thing or two about the olden days. I am I sorry. Fuck. I, I really am in a hurry. Ah, uh, it is a pity. No point, it's locked. I'll come back when the funeral is over. No need to go down there. Down where? It's a door. It's up the stairs. No need to go up there. Up the stairs. Uh. If that's going to work, it looks like something's yeah. missing. Looks like something is, isn't it? Nothing. Run. I don't care about you. No need to go down there. It's a door, you're not going down. Good morning. Are you open? Can I buy something from your bakery? No. No, afraid not. Not possible. We're closed. Why? I can wait a while. You can wait, but we're closed all day. Day of mourning. I'm sorry. Please accept my condolences. Don't worry about it. Because of Madame Vorobolg's death, all the shops are closed. Mayor's decision. Try tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow I won't be here. That's a pity. I don't have any money. I have no money. Hmm. Are you going to go down the stairs to the door? Or do you have no need for it? No need to go down there. Yeah.
No need to go down there. Holy crazy cunt.